55 sex-related offences are listed for trial on the 2016 criminal assizes. This is not being taken lightly by the Legal Aid and Counseling Clinic. The organization on Friday brought together a number of women to discuss the issue during a consultation held at a national stadium. Two mothers, Sarana Phillip and Stacey Ann Campbell, spoke to GBN about the need for women to form supportive groups with the aim of educating and empowering other women who are affected by domestic violence. Oh, one of our challenges we have facing is, um, is rape and domestic violence where we have um, women being battered by the husband and by the, the boyfriend. And I think that um, solutions is where like, we can seek help from we have the legal aid and counsel, we have the police division, and we also have um, child care authority where um, parents could um, bring their children that are facing with these situations where they have been raped and are unable to cope with it. They can you know, seek help. So I think to curve the beast of domestic violence that um, women, we need to stick together and not trash each other trashing each other is a bad thing you know we come down on each other so much forgetting that we can only be stronger if we you know a chain is as weak as its weakest link and if we hold together as women that we can help push each other forward and we should as women you know as miss burke was saying work together as a team for women you know encouraging each other you know reporting yes violence mm -hmm. and not saying it's not our business. Guidance counselor Shauna Thomas Kofi says it is only through unity can communities help eradicate domestic violence. She said of concern is the increased number of sexual offenses on the list of assizes. For the court has um, proven the list of offenses that deals with um, sexual offenses have increased and they continue to increase so the beast is growing and the only way to slaughter it is through information through advocacy and knowing how as a community as families as churches as schools as um, inter-strategic agencies that we can really put our voices together to say no among those 55 cases listed Rape stood out as the most prevalent, followed by carnal knowledge and incest, with a few cases of indecent exposure. Colin Campbell, GBN News.